I am sitting here in my office at the gear group and I was getting ready for um, getting together some products for live videos that we do on Facebook for the gear group and was kind of starting to do some work with a smart notebook that has been sitting in my office for maybe the last few months and I thought you know this is kind of silly um, I could use this as a tool and I could help myself get more organized. And so I thought I would put myself out there today. Um, I need accountability partners that also might want to get organized. So I'm pretty organized at work. I have lists. I'm a list person. So I do lists all day and keep like track of all of my tasks and all of my meetings and all of my client work just on notebook lists. But lately, um, as we live more in the tech world that we do, um, I've been intrigued by these smart notebooks. And I have one here. I don't know if you guys have ever used these or seen these. But um, basically what this is, is it allows you to use it like a notebook. And then you can kind of take the file and either email it to yourself or upload it to a cloud and to organize yourself kind of in a more paperless fashion, which is kind of intriguing to me because it's eco-friendly, but also because I have stacks of papers all over my desk that I need to get rid of. So I am kind of taking the initiative to learn about this smart notebook and how it works. And I thought if others were interested that um, maybe we could do this together a little bit. Um, so what I learned so far today, let me just share where I'm at in my process here. Um, I took my smart notebook, and you can see here it's just like a spiral bound notebook. And you open it up, and I made some notes. So here's my list of notes. These are my to-dos. On the other side, you'll see that there's icons, and then I have designated what these icons are going to mean to me in my smart notebook. So every time I'm in a client meeting, for example, I can put my customer notes um, under this icon here that looks like the rocket. And it will allow me to file these, it sounds like, by type. So if every time I make notes on the bottom of these pages here, these are really light, but hopefully you can see them, um, there are icons at the bottom there that you can circle. So if I'm doing a customer note, I can circle it at the bottom here, make all of my notes, and then I've downloaded an app here on my iPhone that is the Rocketbook app. And basically, the icon looks like this here. I'm going the wrong way. This is so backwards. Okay, see the bottom one in the middle there that says Rocketbook? It's a free app that comes along with it. You open it up and it allows you to scan the pages. So I've scanned a couple of pages just to try this for myself. And I've got my list there that I've already scanned in. Now the cool thing about this is, is for us here at the Gear Group, we use email and everything, but we also use a, um, we use Slack. Um, I don't know if others may be using that or have heard about it. Um, let me know if you do, if you haven't, or, or what you think. But we use that internally for communication. It's kind of an instant messenger. So, you know, we can just message each other back and forth. So we have different feeds. Um, so we can talk to each other. You know, I can talk to another employee just back and forth. And it might be in regard to a certain project. And in all honesty, we also use it to plan lunch. Like if somebody's going to get lunch, we'll talk about that and, and instant message each other back and forth. Anyway, I can send my smart notes um, to a few different places and, and here are the destinations and Slack being one of those for me. So I have went in and set up, um, again, if you remember back when, in the notebook, it says my customer notes are gonna be the rocket and I have set the rocket to email to myself at carly at thegeargroup.com. So when I do a note and I want it to be emailed to me, I'm, I'm starting a file on my computer that'll be called customer notes. I can send it electronically and have a file on my desk for customer notes and then file them by customer. That's how I'm thinking I'm gonna use this. Um, it's gonna be a new process for me, but frankly in the past I've found myself um, like, writing notes and I have like old notebooks from the past and I keep these notebooks and 
at the end of the year when I go through all my stuff, I kind of feel like a hoarder because I have a ton of notebooks and there's really no reason to keep all this and there's really no reason to not have all of this electronically. I'm, I mean, I'm on, I have my iPhone, I have a Mac, I have all these resources, so why am I still using the antiquated process of writing notes? But on the other hand, you might be like me in that you like to write on paper. Um, I didn't want to take that away from myself. So I thought this smart notebook might be like the answer for me. Um, you know, it is one of the products we sell at the gear group and you can get it branded and such. But for me, I'm just like, you know, trying to figure out if it's a viable product, I guess, you know, and, and it, am I going to use it moving forward? So I kind of need some accountability partners. If there's other people looking to get organized, my thought is with this, that what I, I might do is I might come back on here once a week and kind of let you guys know how this process is working for me and how I have been able to organize myself so that, um, Basically, I'm kind of accountable to Facebook. You know, I'm a kind of accountable to you guys for this. And I can kind of put this product to test and see if it's something that's worth getting. Um, the other thing is, I'm not sure how many total pages there are in here, but you can reuse the pages. They kind of feel almost like a really smooth plastic a little bit. And you use a regular pen with it. So, I mean, you do have to have a specific pen. Um, it's a pilot. It's a friction, it looks like, pilot. Um, you do have to have a specific pen, but it writes just like a normal pen. It'll actually write on normal paper and everything, too. Um, but if you use that on here, you can take a mic microfiber cloth, and then I can get part of this wet, and then I can dry it with the dry part of the cloth, and I can continue to use these pages and reuse these pages. Um, something I haven't really explored yet is to upload anything to the cloud. I don't know if others are using this and doing it, but if you are, share with me. Um, I'd love it if people could teach me more about if they're using something like this or if they've tried it and it did or didn't work for them and just your feedback and thoughts on it. But for now, I'm just going to start with small goals and just trying to get my client, nor note, uh, my client notes organize it on my desktop in electronic fashion, and then also trying to use this with our internal messenger Slack to see how good that is going to work. So um, thanks for jumping on with me today. If you have any thoughts, I would love to interact with you on this. And I'll jump back on next week and let you know how it's going. So far, I've got my to-dos on here and client meetings and such that I have throughout the week. I'll kind of try to use it and um, come back on and let you guys know what I think. So happy Friday. I will see you next week.